Any idea how many jobs are on the line here? Not as yet. This is now becoming a familiar sort of scenario where these big tech companies make an announcement to the stock markets that they plan to cut back on their global workforce. But then the details about how it impacts on the ground here drop very slowly. So at the minute, it's a waiting game as far as IDA Ireland, as far, as far as the government are concerned. They haven't heard anything yet. This seems to be the last of the big players in terms of these type of announcements we've heard from Facebook's parent group Meta, we've heard from Amazon this week, a very small number of Irish positions affected there, giving some hope that this mightn't be catastrophic. Microsoft, as you said, announced earlier this week, 10,000 of its global workforce are to go. Now we have Google's parent company, Alphabet. So they announced the news this morning in a statement and they had said that they'd undertaken a rigorous review across product areas and functions to ensure that its people and roles were aligned with its highest priorities as a company. They went on to say the roles we're eliminating reflect the outcome of that review. They cut across alphabet, product areas, functions, levels, and regions. So no detail there, a very generalized statement. It's understood that IDA Ireland, the inward investment body, are talking to Google Ireland today. These pictures from an IDA uh, trade mission to Silicon Valley last April, the then Tonishtown Minister for Enterprise presenting Alphabet's chief executive with a special recognition award showing just the, the strength of the relationship between Google and Ireland. There were some small concerns around that time about future investment into the country, but that was seen as a very important moment from uh, Ireland Inc.'s point of view. It's understood also that the Minister for Enterprise, Simon Coveney, is due to sit down with Google Ireland early next week. That had been scheduled before this announcement, but it's a critical part of the tech sector here. Over 5,000 people directly employed by Google, but almost 10,000 when you take into account contractors and so on. All right, Paul, thanks very much for that update.